what is up you guys today we're gonna be doing a full walk around video for you guys on all three Mitsubishi Eclipses I currently have mine sitting in here we have Lazy's 428 Turbo DSM um, I know we've been mentioning about the whole Fast and the Furious situation but with this whole thing going on with the whole quarantine thing we're not even allowed to go into the L area the L area right now it's like super strict no one's on the street it's super empty and rolling in a group of cars like this is super sketch. We might get pulled over. We don't want to get into issues. I still want to put out content. I don't want to stop. And this is why we're doing this video for you guys. Um, as far as right now, I need to go get gas like always. And it would actually be a really good time to actually go ahead and uh, keep breaking in the clutch for the car. So far, we only have around 110 miles on it. Um, and I think we're going to need a total of 300. Here, Danny. DSM squad for you guys. We got Carlos, Danny, and we got Lazy. Lazy, the only one that didn't wash his car. Mine was already clean, so we didn't even need it. So I'm guessing this is like the first spot we're gonna shoot out. Hey, please. Don't be scared. <laughs> Where are my slicks? Your slicks? Jesus, dude. <laughs> Freaking lazy. <laughs> Alright, they're first up. He needs to see an exhaust out the hood again. Do a pull! No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Alright, so what year is it? It's a 98. 98. RS. If I had really too much on side, just the front lip. Front lip. The hood. Carbon fiber hood. Carbon oh, cowl. carbon fiber cowl, yeah. Cowler. Cool. Cowler's carbonetic. RPF ones. RPF ones. Damn, bro, we're recording. Damn! <laughs> Lady was mad and she did in the Tesla. <laughs> She's probably faster than all of us. <laughs> Carbon fiber, what do you call this? Um, Rear. The what? hatch spoiler? Hatch spoiler, yeah. And you have a carbon fiber wing just like me. Yes, you have a rear diffuser. I have the rears. I have put these on. That the winglets? The yeah, and then these, aren't these uh, Lazy's old taillights? They're Lazy's old taillights. They're LEDs. Thank you. Me. Thank you. <laughs> Little toe strap. The toe strap, and then. Carbon fiber gas lid okay, guys. There you, go. you have the carbon fiber airbag delete you're completely gutted yeah it must be nice all right so i know most of you guys don't know this used to be my old 428 engine that was in this car before we swapped it danny ended up getting it and he actually boosted it it's running eight pounds of boost okay that's what basically what 428s can handle huh yeah that's like the, that's like unless you get it tuned which i think you should i am i just <laughs> cost money dude <laughs> Pretty type S. Type S, the one I have as well. Exhaust manifold. You got the exhaust coming all the way down here. Poly motor mounts, DC coilovers, DC strut bar, MSD ignition, Megan radiator, and you got the Mishimoto front mount. <laughs> Let me see the photos. 
I'm gonna put the edited one on the screen. All right, so for everyone, just give us a quick recap of your modifications into the car. Oh, I got this VIS uh, Evil Style Hood. Which you're gonna paint, right? Which I'm gonna paint. Right, and then I see you have a broken splitter. <laughs> Broken canards, uh, JDM fog lights. <laughs> Bro, everyone roasts lazy for this right now. <laughs> running some uh, Evo 7 Brembos. Evo 7 Brembos. Like Evo missing a door cap right there on the yeah, side. Yeah, missing the door cap. And then, of course, you got the whole Sharpie going on. These are the Carbonetix fender flares. Yeah, the Carbonetix fender flares. Okay. All by myself. EDM tail lights. Yeah. We're diffuser yeah, from who? This is from uh, Mike Wazowski. Oh, hey, shout out to Mike Wazowski. And a lot of you guys know him as well with the purple DSM. He actually makes these. And for the engine bay, good old 428, same as Danny, poly motor mounts, Megan Racing Coilovers. Um, what turbo is this? Like a Turbonetics? It's a Turbonetics. Right, old school star exhaust manifold. Uh, tall wastegate, the filter. Gritty. Everyone, I feel like every DSMer wants a gritty bluff out. <laughs> Intercooler <laughs> piping. And you're gonna be doing the exhaust of the hood soon, huh? So you guys can see the hole right here so that it can sound loud again. Usually I have a front bumper on, but when I drive it, I like to drive bumperless because it has a carbon creation slip and that lip is discontinued. And a lot of you guys ask what type of wheels I'm running. I am running Ray's Gram Light 57GR. I'm running the Evo 9 Brembos. A lot of you guys also ask what size fuel extensions I'm running. These are off of Subaru WRX. For the rear, we're running a carbon fiber spoiler just like Danny. The only difference is that the top was painted so it flows more with the car. The centerpiece and the carbon fiber rear lip or diffuser, whatever you want to call it. Uh, Carbonetic sells a set as well. And I'm running the Gretti exhaust, just the muffler. My interior is pretty simple. It's just uh, some bright Lomaxes uh, matched to the good old Takata harnesses. I'm running an NRG quick release and hub, a Carbonetics carbon fiber uh, shift knob, AEM boost and air fuel ratio gauge, and, uh, and then an already steering wheel. So you can see it's like beautiful, it's, it's Italian. Now for the motor, I'll give you guys a quick recap on what it has. So you guys know it's the Evo uh, 8 motor. We are running a Mishimoto half rod, AEM intake, Grady blowout valve like every DSM has, ETS intercooler piping, DC uh, strut bar. I'm running a fuel fuel lap pressure regulator, FIC 1,000 with 1,050 fuel injectors, <laughs> AM320 fuel pump, Megan Racing exhaust manifold, stock Evo 9 turbo, um, aftermarket O2 dump and downpipe, and it's an open downpipe as well. It's nothing crazy. Who am I? So basically, we're at the Tyler Mall right now. <laughs> Who am I, guys? So basically, <laughs> so basically, we're at the Tyler Mall. Nobody's here. Nobody is here. And like, we came here to take the pictures in the <laughs> in the um, what's it called? The parking structure. But. There's 50 around the corner right over there. So we can't we can't go in the we can't go in the garage. So this is what Ooh, we were shooting? Yeah. yeah. Alright, we just made it to our next shooting location. I'm gonna roll a quick cinematic of this dope little view here. Hope you guys enjoy it.
Yo, I ain't here for the money, I ain't here for the fame. Though it might be nice to own a jet plane, I'ma do it all for you. Come along and see it's true, but the world is pretty cold. You might need a sweater too. I'ma put a ride on. So that was pretty much for the video. It was a very random video because we were just driving around everywhere trying to find like shooting locations for the cars, considering that everything's closed. There's like no people on the street. Um. It was actually cops driving around the mall. Yeah, so it's like everyone's in quarantine right now and we wanted to go to the Fast and the Furious house. But again, we pretty much have to work with what we have right now as far as like keeping it local and just trying to do some photo shoots and get videos out for you guys. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. Um, anyways, that's pretty much for today. The car is getting fuel cut for some reason at around 5,000 RPM. The car feels really slow. It felt way quicker when it was on the front wheel drive setup. Um, so we're going to have to find out what's going on with that. Maybe hopefully it's just the tune and I'll fix it. But the car does feel really slow right now. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one.